Well, Mike and Ashley, she's worried, she's nervous. She says she's been crying about the whole ordeal since Saturday. She just can't understand why any of this even happened. I don't know where they're at. I don't know where their babies are at. I don't know nothing where they're at. This stuff has got me a nervous wreck. A grandmother's heart in shambles. Linda Barker says she's been there for 28-year-old Kelsey Hopper and 29-year-old Brittany Hopper for years. She's never seen them involved in anything like what police say was captured on camera June 3rd. Here's video from Republic Street. Cincinnati police say the sisters and an unidentified man were driving this mismatched, beat-up Hyundai Sonata, firing a BB gun at the homeless and over the Rhine in downtown. Police say two people had minor injuries. And I can't believe they did that. They're grown adults with babies on top of that. How would they like somebody doing that to their kids? That's not right. After many tips, police found the car in Covington today, apparently spray painted as a disguise. They impounded it. Police say the three also fired BBs at people on Guest Street, at 7th and Plum Street, and on Corwine Avenue. They were caught on camera in a garage at the banks, holding the BB gun and putting it under a car. Barker says each sister has three children, describing them as good moms, but calling what we see here senseless and painful. They need to pay for what they did. They really do because they wouldn't like nobody doing that to their family. Now, each uh, sister faces three counts of assault and warrants have been signed. Cincinnati police are also encouraging them to turn themselves in here at District 1. Reporting live, Dan Griffin, WLWT News 5.